Hey guys, it's Mike White with Baby Monkey Studios, and I am here to talk to you today about my new drop down menu module for XCart 5. And I'm pretty excited about this. This is one of my first modules that I'm releasing commercially for XCart 5. And uh, here we are in the admin, in the interface. It adds a new uh, uh, menu item under content drop down menu. And that takes you to this page. And uh, we're at the root level and we can tell right that right there and it's it's very similar to your current interface I mean you can uh, make edits here you can add items uh, you can reorder items uh, it's quite nice um, that's just the standard interface for for XCart so if we were to add an item here and save changes and you know you can control the visible for all of any visitors or anonymous or logged in only okay and then see we can add sub menu so you click edit and you just make a new item and this is going to be sub one we'll put a link save changes okay so let's go look at the front side and see how it works refresh and here's our new menu. Now that last uh, entry, we don't really want that at the top, so we'll just arrange it. Put this up here. All right. So we have root one, a root with no subs, root three, root four, and there's the subs. Now the styling is just really default X-Cart styling. You're going to want a style that yourself. Um, I just tried to not interfere at all and kept it as minimal as possible. Most of the CSS in this module is actually just stock X-Cart CSS. Uh, there's really nothing that should be incompatible with anything that you've got or anything that you want to do. Okay, well that's it. It's just a simple one level drop down. Uh, there's no subs of subs. It's just one level and it overrides the primary menu of the simple CMS module or the stock top menu that comes with XCart without the CMS module enabled. And it will work regardless of, of which menu you have. Okay, thanks a bunch for watching. I hope lots of you guys buy this module and support my efforts. Talk to you soon.